Hi guys, Jay here. Welcome back to another episode of Destiny Child. As you guys can see, I've maxed the bond form of Bartori and this is her alternate costume. Pretty nice. And on top of that, the current world boss trial is live right now, running all the way to the 15th of January. Uh, the world boss is dual face MOA and for those of you who have not played this world boss trial before, a, this is a boss that shares uh, its HP with all players in the game and instead of a 5 man, 5 child team, you'll be bring a 20 child team. You can see from here, you will set the front row and the back row. Uh, and of course you need to deal as much damage to the boss as possible and it uses a separate stamina system uh, which refreshes every 2 hours and a max cap of 6 so let's you know, do one battle for you guys to see I mean I'm not very strong so probably get wiped between like, 2 minute 1 2 minute mark or so so during this process, you know, just do as much damage as possible to the boss. The BGM is pretty cool. Probably dead after this attack. Yep. Okay, so that's how roughly the battle goes. Let's go back. So once the entire community is able to you know, kill off the boss, you will be rewarded according to the damage you have done to the boss. And you will get this currency, event currency called the Magic Mirror Fragments and you can get a boost based on the boost child right here, the 4 star child Titina. And then uh, the 2 featured child on this current step up summon. And after you gather the Fragments, you can go to this magic mirror shop to make purchases. As you can see from here, stuff they can buy. I have 4,000 of the currency right now. I'll probably buy this one once I have enough. And of course, as the face of the boss goes by, you can buy. And with this will be unlocked, and you can buy more stuff, including a five star child Luna, you know, other few other 10 all these summon tickets and of course the most important is the robot itself the dual face moa it's something i probably will purchase and then there's also this uh, trial mission few, uh, few categories the cumulative damage one and then this there's this the damage mission and lastly the face 10 mission so um, of course the, as the name suggests the cumulative damage one is the more cumulative damage you do you know you'll clear and the mission one is to do as much damage to the boss in one battle and then lastly once you, re you are playing on the phase 10 boss you know you'll get to clear this one so um, there's a lot of missions you don't need to clear everything as long as you clear any 13 of, I mean a cumulative of 13 of them can unlock the 300 devil pass point and the world boss dual face more. Now of course once if you are placed higher in the rank you know you can get stuff from here you know including another few copies of more but you know these are usually very very top players you can see they've got the pretty good team 
much better than mine. All, all of them are fully limit broke, break good and uh, broke. <laughs> yeah, so that's that. And then uh, there's also this more more paradise two zero nine. Um, this one is for you to roll for uh, uh, rewards. You can you can get the rolls based on the things that you do. You know, every fifty stamina you do, and you spend, you can get a roll up to a maximum of five daily. And then uh, every Lisa's daily mission, every three Lisa's daily mission you cleared, uh, you can get one roll up to a maximum of three times. And then every ten multi summon using crystal, you can get one roll up to a maximum of 99 per day and then every two devil rumble you get one try one roll and a maximum of five so uh that's there are quite i mean good rewards including no crystals onyx and um no blood even uh blood gem and once you reach the goal you'll go back to the start and for every completion of the route you'll get different rewards including the five star you know soul cartel for the new year the one the first one you've cleared you get the normal one and then the 10 drive you get the holo version and after that after sub the subsequent completion after 12 you'll get a three to five star so hard to get so you know do we really do this one okay so that's it for the video um i do have some i mean i do have a uh, 2006 but I'm not gonna do the step up today probably wait for you know once I get 3008 and I can do the last two steps so today you know just have to make do with multi summon tickets I have four of them I'm gonna use them all today hopefully you know get some duplicate uh, five star challenge to limit break okay let's go first one okay start off with three star Another one. Oh. Okay. No, this is four star. Go detective. Ice dragon. Nothing interesting. Be. The last one's gonna be something good. Nope. Thank. Okay. Let's go. Second one. Oh, let's start off the wall. So net. Uh, whoa, another four star? Okay, Yuna, okay, I can leave it break her. Love the robot dude. Whatever that is. <laughs> Do. Yeah, I would have. I mean, mine it's max limit break, so probably fodder for the evolution charm. Okay. Three star, three star. Three star. Three star. Third time. I get a like five star from ticket. Coding. Davi. Last. 10 multi summon. 
っごくいい感じ。Wow, this summon sucks. And what's the guaranteed four star? And above? Merlin. Great. Okay, used out all my multi summon ticket. So that's it for the video today, guys. You know, hope you guys enjoy it. And if you did, remember to hit on the like button and subscribe to my channel for future content. So see you guys next time. Bye bye.